Yo guys, and yeah, Brad here with a new Premiere Pro tutorial, and today we are doing how to do the green screen effect. Anyway, let's get to it. First, obviously, I have my clip here. I'll just drag that in. I'll just do that. Derpity derp. And we'll just zoom in a bit. So, yeah, and there we go. Just drag it there. And as you see, we have that horrible kind of green screen background. So we do is go to over to effects and just search the word key. And then you want to go down all the way to the bottom. And there's the ultra key. And you want to click and hold and drag over to your clip. And bam. Up here in your effects controls, if you're not on that, just say you're here. Just click to there and bam. Next, you want to do is use the eyedrop tool and just click the darkest piece of the curtain. Mine is down here, and there we go. It obviously doesn't look that good. And I tend to turn that all the way down and that all the way almost to the top. And bam, um, see, there we have a nice green screen kind of effect. And um, now we need a window background, of course. Course. So, um, let's just say, I know, remember to put your video here on the layer track 2 to make sure your background is at the bottom. Oh, yeah, I'll just have a look on here, see if I have a decent clip I can just use. Um, here we go, from my latest video that we've done. Now, now what you're going to do here, if you have one that has noise, you want to unlink it and just get rid of the music. Now, now, as you see here, yeah, let's make sure that's on mute. Yeah, and there we go. Obviously, you can scale to fit this, so it would. There we go. Teenagers, there is a separate album. There we go. Translated it's into a green effect. It looks a lot Just better. I find it works better than the actual After Effects way, but obviously it's personal preference. Anyway, thank you for taking the time to watch this, and I hope this helps. <laughs>